Hello, today I'll be doing a, another program tutorial. Um, well, actually, I'll be doing two program tutorials because I'm doing two programs. So, two for the press of one. So, um, the programs I'll be featuring will be a game where you guess a number, well, guess a number in a range, and the um, second one will be a hangman game with um, flash animations. So, um, I'll just open them up. Okay, so basically in this game, um, it gives a range between 1 and 20, you've got to guess um, a number, you know, in that range. So, um, I'll just go through the program structure. Um, first, um, that's a basic import, um, guess is taken, um, set to not, um, you know, so you, have, you can have the maximum, uh, maximum amount of guesses. Um, I'm not sure how many guesses you get. Um, let's look. I think it's about six. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so um, yeah, guess tokens. Set to not, then you have a basic print saying hello, what's your name? Then you can put an input, um, go to variable, um, it's said as my name in this print. Um, I'll just copy and paste it. Sorry, I'll put it in the description so you can copy and paste it, then play it to your house content. Um, it's you know, it's of explaining it because it's going to take ages. I've got two programs. So, um, okay, let's play it. Okay, so pretty basic. You know, it's a pretty basic, you know, command based game. Um, the graphics on the Commodore 64 are probably better than this. Well, and again, you've got Adventure Games back then. Why am I talking about retro games? Um, okay, so what's your name? Uh, I'll put my YouTube name in. Well, the Muckers, I'm thinking of a number between 1 and 20, to a guess. Okay, so first, um, we'll find the median. Um, that'll be 10, won't it? Your guess is too high, so it's giving you, you know, it's giving you um, hints. So nine, eight, five, ooh, six, seven. Good job, the Mackers. You've guessed my number in six guesses. Wait a minute, who are you? <laughs> I've got to give the program a name. Um, I don't know. I'll call it Alice. There you go. Okay. So, um, the next one will be Hangman. I'll just open up the GUI. Open, uh, Hangman. You, you might know, sir, it's not called Hangman Debug. Yeah, I had a problem with it. And um, I did a massive debug on it. Um, I'll teach you about debugging. Okay. So, program structure here is um, pretty complicated. Um, I'm not going to go through it all, um, just copy and paste it and play it. You will probably need Python uh, 3.2, because um, that's what I'm running on. Um, I've tried 2.6 and 2.7 and they don't work, so now try it. Make sure you've got 3.2. Okay, so you've got the basic import random, and then here you've got something called hangman picks. Um, what these are, um, when you guess the wrong letter, it'll actually draw a hangman. Um, so yeah. It's a, for each um, letter that you get wrong, or which is not in the dictionary, which is here, um, it will draw a hangman. So, um, yeah, you can see. Okay, so um, the first, this is the word list. You've got ant, baboon, badger, pig, you know, and so on. Um, there's only a few there, actually, so it's not very hard. Um, there it does definitions, you know, get a random word from the word list. Um, Find the display board. Um, so print hangman picks. That's basically printing, you know, that one. Then if letter um, is not in the word dictionary, um, put this hangman pick in, you know, and so on. Um, yeah. Yes, yeah, it's, it's pretty. Um, It looks complicated, but um, you know, if you've 
go into Python, it's actually pretty easy. Um, but I'm too lazy to explain it all. Um, okay, so I'll just um, play it. Okay, so here we are. Um, so, miss letter, there's only three there. Um, it can't be hard. Um, so the animals are probably going to be probably a dog or a cat. Or a pat, I don't know. Um, dog. Yep. So I'll just do a fail one. So I know it's not dog. Okay. So yeah, it keeps. Um, I wish you could like um, you know delete these and then just like refresh it. Um, but I haven't found how to do that yet. Okay. So it's probably cat. Yep. Yep. So um, yeah. Yes, the secret word is cat. You have won. Do you want to play again? Um, yeah. Good enough one. Okay. So. Um, a bit more complicated. <laughs> um, five letter word. word. Um, start with S. Oh. oh. That's pretty easy. Maybe I shouldn't have um, just included animals. Maybe I should include, like, um, I guess I could copy and paste the entire dictionary. Um, yeah, that would be good. <laughs> I'll do that. I'll do an update. Um, I might put it on my OS just to, um, as a little novelty. Um, I'll do another one. Oops. I put yeah. And it's still done it. Well, that's a bit of a bug. I'll debug that. Um, no, it's doing it again. Yes. Oh, it's not. Oh, I'm stumped on this one. Oh, I've already guessed it. Uh, oh, this is hard. Don't care. Oh, well, you have run out of guesses. Up to six guesses and not no, correct guesses. The word was turtle. Do you want to play again? Yes or no? No. Okay. Um. I should have been put a command where it just closes the window. Um, so yeah, it's a pretty, it's a pretty fun game. Well, it's a time waster. Um, but you know, a lot of people say it's, it doesn't beat COD. Um, well, this has a better plotline than COD. So um, there you go. That's my opinion. Um, so yeah, I'll pop the source code in. Um, the description, um, then you can copy and paste it to your house content and play it. So, um, yeah, next um, video will be on uh, debugging, and what we're going to do is I'm going to probably put a mistake in and show you how to, um, you know, run a debug to solve bugs and things. So, um, I'll see you then.